Welcome to the first in a series of tutorials on how to program with Ruby on Eros. What I want to show here is how to create some simple GUIs using the Zuby extension that I'm developing. For this example, we're going to create a simple window with two buttons. The first button prints the message hello world and the second button quits the program. For this example, we will use the nano text editor to edit our Ruby code. First, we require the GTK2 module. Now let's create a window with the title button test. We will now create two buttons. The first has the label say hello and the second has the label quit. We want to store the two buttons in a container. In this case, we will add them to a vertical box layout. Let's add the box to the parent window. Now set the window size to 100 by 100. And finally set the window to be visible. Now we need to call the GTK main method to start the application. Now that we've saved the file, we can run the program by typing ruby test1.rb. As you can see, we now have a graphic interface with two buttons, one that says say hello and the other says quit. As you can see, these buttons don't do anything yet. So what we need to do now is to add the functionality to our code. What we will do now is to create a method called say hello. In this method, we will print one line that says hello world using the method puts. In order to associate a block of code with the clicked action for the button, we call its method signal connect. Within this code block, we call our method say hello. For the second button, we create a code block that just calls the internal method GTK main quit. This will quit the application. Now let's save the file and test the result. As you can now see, we have successfully associated the clicked actions of the buttons with their own functionality. I hope that this video will give you a quick idea on how to program with Ruby on Eros and give the idea of how Zuby adopts the GTK2 API. Thanks for watching.